Here in the UK, we've become used to celebrities created by tabloid newspaper and social media, people who've become famous mainly, it seems, for their looks, their likes, and their dislikes, and for plastering them over the internet. They may be accused of bad taste or a lack of talent, but that's probably as far as the criticism goes. In Pakistan, though, challenging conservative norms carries more risk, especially if you're a woman. This week, the country's biggest social media sensation has been facing a court case and, she says, death threats. Shaima Khalil, no, she's not the social media sensation in question, but she does have her story. Kandil Baloch is a Pakistani celebrity. She's been called a model, an actress, and a singer, but she's mainly a social media star. She's also one of the country's most controversial figures, Pakistan's provocatrice extraordinaire. Think Kim Kardashian without the reality TV show, the superstar rapper husband, and the multi-million dollar empire. In a relatively short time, and with the help of many risque YouTube and Facebook videos, Kandil has managed to draw attention to herself. The videos are predictable most of the time she's in bed, in a provocative outfit, exposing as much skin as she can get away with, singing, dancing, or just staring at the camera and pouting. There is the famous one with the bathrobe, another with a low-cut red dress and red lipstick. Many of her posts have gone viral on Pakistani social media. Most have caused a mix of puzzlement and distaste. Who is Kandil Baloch and what is she doing on my timeline? Read one article. What is Pakistan's problem with Kandil Baloch? Read another. Comments varied from, Oh my, what a bold person this is, to, She must be arrested for spreading vulgarity, to, I kind of like her. She is genuinely worthy of the title drama queen. And while her approach to fame is not original, the woman herself is an interesting example of how a typically conservative society like Pakistan both vilifies sex and is obsessed with it. Kandil is among the top 10 most searched names in the country. She has over half a million followers on Facebook, yet there are many calls for her page to be banned. People criticize her for using her body to get attention, yet she's been invited numerous times onto primetime television shows. The same men who rush to see the latest videos are the ones who are quick to call her cheap and offensive. While a lot of feminists here are dismissive of her, some see her as daring. This is a country where girls can still get killed for choosing who they love and marry. In one of her most watched videos, Kandil was very clear about who she wanted to marry. The opposition politician and former cricketer Imran Khan. She proposed to him on camera and was quite distraught when she couldn't meet him in person. She then promised to strip dance if the Pakistani cricket team beat India in the T20 World Cup a few months ago. She even uploaded a teaser for the promised performance, which triggered fierce media criticism. Her Facebook page was blocked for a while, but after many complaints, it was reinstated. Pakistan lost that match, so we'll never really know what could have happened. The latest controversy erupted when she posted selfies of her with the religious scholar Mufti Abdul Kavi. He's a member of the Moon Sighting Committee, the people who decide when Ramadan begins and ends. He's also a judge in one of the Sharia courts in Lahore. The two apparently met for iftar, the Ramadan evening meal after the breaking of the fast, in a Karachi hotel room where Mufti Abdul Kavi was staying. In the pictures, Kandil is seen standing or sitting close to the cleric and wearing his traditional cap. It's still unclear why exactly she was visiting him. But the media were awash with coverage and debate. As a result, the Minister for Religious Affairs suspended the cleric's membership of the Moon Sighting Committee, and he was embroiled in scandal for weeks. Kandil says she now faces death threats and has asked the Ministry of the Interior for armed security. One lawyer brought a case against her in court, saying she's disgraced the Baloch people by using that as her last name. The Baloch are from the restive and conservative province of Balochistan in southwestern Pakistan. The lawyer claimed that she was not a real Baloch. A copy of her passport even made it onto social media, where her real name was revealed, Fozia Azim. This, of course, prompted yet more media speculation. Is Kandil Baloch a real Baloch? One headline said. Whichever way you look at it, Kandil is almost impossible to miss, and not just for the obvious reasons, but because she manages to do what she does in a place like Pakistan. She has provoked debate for being overtly sexual in a country where honor killings still happen, 
and where some mullahs are saying it is okay for a man to lightly beat his wife. Despite all her critics, she's managed to make a name for herself in a nation where many women still struggle to get their voices heard. Shaima Khalil in Islamabad. So, today's program is BCCI's name. Your name is BC. बहुत अच्छा रहेगा पता है क्यों क्योंकि आप लोगों के अंदर रत्ती भर भी स्पोर्ट्समैनशिप नहीं है अगर होती तो ये स्पोर्ट्स में आप लोग तेरी मेरी बिल्कुल भी ना करते मुझे एक बात बताएं मुझे ये बताएं कि आप लोगों को इतना खौफ है हमारे पाकिस्तानी क्रिकेट प्लेयर्स से क्या आप लोगों को इतना डर लगता है हमारे पाकिस्तानी क्रिकेट प्लेयर्स से या फिर आप लोगों के दिल में इतनी नफरत भरी हुई हमारे पाकिस्तानी क्रिकेट प्लेयर्स के लिए कि आप लोगों ने कभी हमारे प्लेयर्स को मौका नहीं दिया आईपीएल में खिलाने का वाई आप लोगों को चाहिए कि इन दोनों देशों के जो रिश्ते हैं इनको मजबूत करें लेकिन नहीं आप लोग ने तो अपनी औकात दिखाई है जाइए जाके कुछ सीखे शाहरुख खान से वो जानते हम पाकिस्तानियों की कदर वो जानते हमारे पाकिस्तानी क्रिकेट प्लेयर्स की कदर और उन्होंने साबित किया अपनी टीम के कोच वसीम अकरम को चुनकर बच्चों आप लोग हमें क्या खिला पाओगे आप लोगों को तो आई I मीन mean, अपने देश के लोगों को पानी तक नहीं पिलाया जा रहा पिच की ग्रास बाद में ग्रीन करना बच्चों पहले जाओ जाके नेकी कमाओ जाके किसी प्यासे को पानी पिलाओ और डोंट वरी बाकी प्यासों को तो मैं संभाल ही रही हूँ समझ नहीं आ रही कि पाकिस्तानी हमारे अवाम इतनी जज्बाती क्यों है इतनी जल्दी उम्मीद छोड़ देते हो यार देखो ये अंदर की खबर मैं बता रही हूँ देखिये बात तय हो चुकी है पाकिस्तान ने ये मैच जीतना है कुछ भी हो जाए तो बिल्कुल डरने की जरूरत नहीं है ओके आज का पैगाम इंडिया के नाम मैं कंदी बलोच आज एक खास ऐलान करना चाहती हूँ एक खास इंसान के लिए बॉलीवुड के किंग खान के लिए सो किंग खान अगर आपकी टीम कोलकाता नाइट राइडर इस दफा आईपीएल को विन करती है तो मैं उसको सेलिब्रेट करूंगी और कुछ इस तरह से सेलिब्रेट करूंगी कि होश वालों के होश उड़ जाएंगे सोते हुए लोग जाग जाएंगे और जागे हुए लोग सो नहीं पाएंगे 
खड़ा हुआ बैठ जाएगा बैठा हुआ खड़ा हो जाएगा आई मीन बैठे हुए लोग खड़े हो जाएंगे और खड़े हुए लोग बैठ जाएंगे कुछ ऐसा करूंगी कुछ ऐसा करूंगी कि लोग परेशान हो जाएंगे लव यू ऑल